This is one of the worst decisions in all of constitutional history. Um, and since you mentioned my students, I am very proud of them. You, you had one of them on earlier, Kermit Roosevelt. Yep. You also had a graphic from another one, William Bode. William Bode is a Federal Society superstar. He clerked for John Roberts. He's conservative. He's the most cited person by the court itself under age 50. He's a former teaching assistant of mine. Very proud of him. Very critical of this case in the New York Times. Um, and I would encourage your audience to, to read that one. Um, Sai Prakash, one of my other protégés, clerked for Thomas Obode, clerked for the Chief Justice. The Chief Justice loves Obode. Sai Prakash is also, I think, one of the five most cited people by the Supreme Court, a winner of Federal Society Awards, as is Will Bode, conservative, cited by the dissenters in this case. Um, the court says it believes in originalism. That's the text of the Constitution. It's history and structure. Um, let's hold them to that. The dissenters actually made a compelling case. And it's just really easy for your audience because this is short. You can read the thing. Yes. It talks about bribery. And it says when, when a president get, um, accepts a bribe, for example, oh, he can be impeached. One day she and after impeachment, they're subject to criminal prosecution just like everyone else. And, and yet the court somehow said, oh, no, if a president commits bribery, we, we could never actually have once out of office criminal proceedings against that ex-president. That is what I meant when I said it's making the Constitution itself unconstitutional. And read it for yourselves, ladies.